Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So the heat has finally arrived here. I know it was hot like across the US and it was pretty cold here. Now it's it's warm and Ike's not happy, but cleaned the whole house last night, every Monday night, that's kind of my routine. And uh, so this bathroom was spotless. And then Ike, he loves to lay in the bathtub. So when he gets in the bathtub, there's a little bit of water left. And then the dirt on his paws, a little bit of dust, you know. And then there's footprints everywhere. Even though I was on my hands and knees cleaning the floor, now there's footprints everywhere. Anyway, uh, oh, my newsletter, I have to show some pictures for you guys. We're building a doggy ramp for Ike because we live in a split level house and he's got that shoulder issue. So we're building a doggy ramp. So now when he can come in the house and go, he doesn't have to go down any steps. So anyway, okay, on to today's video today. I talked about this in a video a couple days ago and I just thought I would do a uh, better than video. So I've got uh, five alternatives, in my opinion, that are better than the Lancome Genifique, which is uh, 89 bucks. This is one ounce, but it feels, it feels so much bigger than one ounce. You know what I mean? I guess this, this is probably like the thickest, so it's probably almost like bulletproof type glass. It's so thick. So most of the weight is probably that. Um, anyway, a lot of people like this one. Uh, for me, let me see if I can do a little, oh, here we go. I mean, it's got a nice texture to it, and a lot of people love it. What I dislike about it, my skin's pretty dry. I don't prefer uh, a ton of denatured alcohol. Even in this, I can smell the denatured alcohol. I'll handle it and like sunscreens and things like that, but I just prefer not to use it as little as I can. And it also has fragrance in it. It's got uh, citronella and then fragrance, limonene, things like that, so overall, uh, it does have some nice ingredients in there, which I like. I think a lot of people really enjoy some of the ferments, the Bafita ferment. Uh, overall, uh, one of the closest dupes is probably going to be the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Serum, which is probably sitting here somewhere, but I know I don't see it. Uh, or it's probably in my cabinet. Yeah, here we go. This is actually a close dupe, but uh, yeah, it's the same price, so it really doesn't help much with the price if you get this one. So I've got some alternatives. And I'm going to list these in order of how I prefer them. So the first alternative to Lancome is going to be the Numbers in Number 3 Skin Softening Serum. It's $19. Uh, it's got the most uh, similar ingredients, uh, bifida, niacinamide, sodium hyaluronic, and adenosine. And that's also got some other nice ingredients as well. No scent to this one and no alcohol. So overall, if you're looking for a really nice dupe, this one's also, this bottle is like super heavy too. Yeah, they're both heavy. I mean, one ounce really isn't that much but they make it look huge in these very thick bottles. So overall, I believe I reviewed this one a while ago. Overall, this is going to be my first pick. It's very nice. It's got a ton of other beneficial ingredients in it. Inubuzin is a really nice brand to uh, pick shop from. They've got some really nice products. So this is going to be my first option uh, overall, especially if you have uh, oily or dry skin. It's really got a really nice texture, which soaks in pretty quickly. Yeah, so very nice product. Much better, in my opinion, than the Lancome. Next up, this one is going to be the most expensive one on the list, but if you can get it on sale, it's going to be a lot cheaper. So, and this brand is, I don't know, check out the sites. I'll link to all these below, but certain sites will have it much cheaper, and then the next week it'll be something else. So, the Manual Bifida Biome Complex Ampule. Uh, this one's also got the Bifida, it's got the sodium hyaluronic, it's got the niacinamide, and then it also has the yeast extract that the um, Lancome has. So this one's a really nice option uh, from them. They also have a mist, I think, and a toner, which are also very similar to the Lancome with the exception of the alcohol and things like that. So overall, this one's a really nice one. Uh, Manu has some really nice stuff, although their sunscreen that came out recently I did not love. Oh, that's not very good. There we go. Yeah, their sunscreen, I was not a huge fan of because it was too scented. But a lot of their stuff is fragrance-free, so anyway, there's just a little bit. Probably the least radiant finish out of all of my op out of all my alternatives. Okay, next up, this one's usually, it's about 13, 14 bucks, and this is, I'm going to say, my third bottle of it, the V Green Rishi Barrier Serum. It's really nice. So in here, we've got, uh, we've got the ferment, the yeast ferment. We've got... Uh, niacinamide we've got adenosine and then we've got sodium hyaluronate so for some similar ingredients we've got most of them it doesn't have the bifida but it's also got some other mushroom extract and it's just really lightweight it really works well uh, after cleansing and toning it's really super nice super light serum 
soaks in quickly, plays well with other products. I really enjoy this one and it's probably the most affordable one on the entire list as well. So if you haven't tried this one from Bee Green, check it out. It's really nice. I think they changed the packaging, but anyway. Okay, a couple more. So this one has uh, anise fruit extract for scent. The scent is really not noticeable, but it's the Isn't Tree Bifida Ampule. Let me see if I smell anything. I really don't smell anything with it, but um, the texture of this one, I would say this is more geared towards dry skin because once it soaks in, it has to a super radiant finish, but this is probably... Uh, one of the closer dupes to it. It's 20 bucks. So in here we've got Bifida, we've got Saki, and sodium hyaluronic, and then a few other goodies in here. So this one's really nice. A lot of people absolutely love it. I'm so-so on it, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything because a lot of people have really good luck with it. So nothing wrong with that. And then last but not least, this is going to be the thickest one out of all of them. And I've repurchased this one now three times, I want to say. So this one's 28 bucks. It's a Neogen Dermology Real Ferment Micro Serum. So in here, we've got Bifida Ferment, we've got Yeast Extract, we've got Niacinamide, and then we've got Sodium Hyaluronic. So if you have drier skin, this one's a really nice serum. You can just use it uh, after toning, where you'd use, normally use your serum. It's got a really nice um, like gel lotion texture to it. I don't know. Can you see that? Yeah. Okay, there we go. And once it soaks in, it sets to a really nice finish and layers well under sunscreen and things like that. I'm wearing it today right underneath my sunscreen. So this one I really enjoy. So if you have to pick one of them, if price isn't an issue, I'm going to say if, you have, if you're looking for something that's a nice serum, the Neogen's great or the Manual is also wonderful. And if price is a bigger issue, the Numbuzin is wonderful. Their other stuff is really good. So their toners are great too. So... Um, anyway, so I decided to come up with a few options because that this one for 90 bucks is overpriced and overrated in my opinion. And then a lot of these options are also cruelty free, whereas I don't think Lancome is, but don't quote me on that. I'm pretty sure they aren't, but I'm not sure. So I should have checked. So anyway, so I will link to all these uh, below. I'm curious your thoughts, if you have any alternatives or if there's anything else you're curious about dupes for. I love doing dupes because I just love trying all the different stuff and seeing what might be similar and uh, what works for people and what doesn't work for people. So uh, leave a comment below and I will see you guys more tomorrow. Thank you so much. Oh, Ike's here. There he is. It's his dirty footprints. Anyway. Okay, thanks so much. I will see you guys more tomorrow. Bye, guys.